from. Daily Forex, this is Chris. Taking a look at the euro and the pound, you can see the euro has fallen a bit to test the 121.5 level. I think we're going to run into a lot of support here, so this should end up being a buy on the dips situation. Um, I think the bullish flag suggests that we are going to go to the 1.23 level, and longer term, that does make sense from a structural standpoint. Um, the uh, 120 to 119 level uh, features also the 50-day EMA coming in right here. So I do think that um, even if we break down here, there's going to be buying. Keep in mind that this is thin liquidity and the Brexit negotiations continue. Same thing here in the pound. Uh, lots of support um, down at 132.5. And the 50-day EMA, uh, of course, will come into play as well. Uh, the market um, will continue to see uh, head headlines out there moving the markets around. I think eventually we do try to break out. That's kind of been the analysis all along. Um, unfortunately, we get the occasional tweet storm or something like that that throws the market algorithms into hyperdrive. Um, and in a low volume environment, that makes it especially dangerous. But it still looks buying the dip seems to be the best way going forward.